Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 12 of Let's Play Ape Escape. Now this could be the finale of the main story, although this won't be the finale of the Let's Play. And one thing I did discover in between episodes, you are allowed to exit the level, you know, just by going like this. Hang on, you know what? I might as well show you, because it would make more sense. And you'll get to keep the progress that you had. So you won't, you know, you won't get warned like, oh, if you exit the level, you have to do all this again. Nope, you have all your progress saved. In fact, that gate to the castle should still be open. Now, I don't know if it solves every puzzle or opens every gate that you did that are operated by, say, buttons and stuff in every stage. But it's certainly well for this one. So, take advantage of that if you have to. Like, maybe there's a stage that gives you a lot of triangles right away. Then you can go get the triangles, exit the level, re-enter the level, get all the triangles again, and just repeat the process as much as you want. So you have that option if things are a little grim. In fact, because of this, we're able to get an extra life so soon. Which is good, because I don't have as many lives as before. Okay, there's a button over there. I don't know what that operates. Let me stay on the high ground. That might be the better idea. I think you can stay on this? Yes, you can. Okay. Oh, that guy's lounging. Hope I can get the sneak on him. Well, I thought I could, but then it just looked right at me. Well, I still got him caught anyway, so it's no big deal. Ugh, the draw distance is going to make this area a little bit more hazy than it actually is. Oh, hold on, I see a Spectre coin up here. wonder how big this area even is. Usually when you go to a spot where there's no music, it makes you feel like you're really, really close to the end. Okay, that's a teleporter. That should take me into the castle, I think. And that's the uh, platform that was right above the beam. We're at the castle, or at least on the doorstep of it. I'm guessing a monkey's gonna try and get in there and unleash a UFO. So let's try to catch it before it gets in there. Except I don't really know where it is. Is that even for a UFO? Seems that way. That's usually a UFO pod. There's two of them right there. Or is that supposed to be... Is that a turret? I don't even know. Now, I know you can retain your progress if you were to exit a stage. What I don't know is do you retain your progress if you get a game over? That might be a whole other issue. And I haven't even tested that theory. Because so I'd like to, you know... Not a, get a game over on purpose. Just a thought, I guess. Okay, so where are we going? Up there? Well, there's a Spectre Queen. So I think we have to get up there eventually. Oh! Oh, that's a problem. That monkey also knows how to push buttons. I don't know what exactly this means, other than that family got a little too close for comfort. I think I have to stand on that, do I? Ow! Ow nope! That was not it. Or if it was, I stood on the wrong spot. Wait a minute, where are we going? Up here? 
Okay, it looks like that's where we gotta go. Up there. Aha! There's a button. And that lets me go down there. Question is, do I want to go down there? Or... Should I just go up here first? Okay, I was a bit worried about that because I thought I was just, my head was going to hit the fan blades. I mean, I my hair is very spiky. It's almost a part of my body now. <laughs> That's how thick that hair gel is. Okay, there's the monkey. Let me see if I can just catch him with a drop. Or just do that. Now what do I do? Go down here? It's kind of hard to tell. Look how fast those blades are going. I don't know if I trust that. Yeah, I think that might be in my best interest to just go back. Yeah, let's, let's not be stupid. Besides, I think I can get to that ledge if I go that way. But is that where I need to go? Oh, you know what? We had to catch monkeys anyway to get through the door. So I think what I just need to do is catch the monkey and then go back. Rather than just try to risk my life. Because what's down there is definitely not going to be important. And if it is, I can always revisit it later. Like, post-game. I just hope it won't come to that. Uh-oh. Okay, you can't really hit it that easily. So there's two monkeys over there. Ah! Damn. It's even worse that they know where you're going to be. So it's hard to dodge a bunch of shots. See? How do they know I was going to be right there? Other than, you know, me going walking straight forward. I don't have many means to fight back. And see, that's terrible. Like, what's the point of a tracker if you're just gonna, like, curve completely to the wrong way? Where are you going? Why did you... Oh, for God's sake. Why did you go there? That makes no sense. You were curving left while it was still right. Why would you even do that? Wait, is there a safe set? Safe zone? I think I should wait for it to shoot. Oh, for God's sake! I was hitting R1, and for some reason, my jump completely dropped. Why? Why did it drop the jump? So it turns out these guys have invincibility time. Okay, so I gotta use all, all my tracking shots. Just for it to possibly miss anyway. Okay, that time it did not miss. Oh, but I might die anyway if it keeps shooting. Okay, I thought I took two hits in a row. That would have been unfair. 
Okay, we actually deked him a little. Okay, maybe it won't shoot from back here. Okay, I think I actually found a safety zone. Yeah, but it's gonna be on high alert the whole time. So it's not gonna be easy to hit him. Also, why don't I just go back for the cookies? I pretty much had a way to not die. And then I died anyway. Are you kidding me? I hate when it shoots, and then when it stops shooting, it's able to shoot again. Like, immediately. So it can be very difficult to dodge them if they're already gonna be on high alert. Like, perpetually. I mean, how can it not be on high alert? I shot down its UFO. So, we might find out sooner or later, do I retain my progress if I die? I hope I do. Oh! Oh my god, it kept spinning? It just continued to spin. <laughs> There's another of those crates that I can't do anything with. So I know I have to revisit this stage. I'm just seeing like for how many crates I gotta do that for. So I can go this way. Or I can go that way. Why don't we go through this door first? Okay, I know what I need to do. Use the RC car for this. Oh, oh, no, what are you doing? Why are you get out of there? I think I have to get you on the platform. And while that's going, I gotta get on the platform, too. Did it make it? It made it. I gotta keep it there so I can get through this way. Oh, nice! I got a billiard table over there. Oh, nice! Now that's what you call a snooker shot. Boosh. I think I'm done with the car for now. I gotta deal with this mecha dreidel, so to speak. <laughs> did I see another monkey? Yeah, I did see another monkey. What happened to music? Why did it get so calm? Damn it, why would you know to turn around now? Also, that guy over there is not helping. That's you. So now I gotta get rid of him, too. Oh, get the apple. Get the cookie, I mean. I almost said get the apple. That's not an apple. Oh my god! Every time it shoots! Wow, these guys, these monkeys with the guns really piss me off. And that's not going to be a good time for me, because nearly all of them have guns. Like, what is their gun fetish going on with these apes? Too bad they never accidentally shot themselves with that. I don't catch them a lot faster. I'm just saying. Oh, good, an extra life. So I was lacking in that department. Wait a minute, aren't these doors? Turns out these don't even open. What the hell? 
Which way am I going? Up? No, it doesn't look like it. I thought these doors would open too. I mean, look at this one. I guess I have to leave that alone and just go the other way. I only came here for a monkey or two. Alright, so you know what? That's still a good deal. Like, anytime you're not leaving with nothing, that's good in my book. And I don't have a book. Trust me, you wouldn't want me to write. Like, if I had to write, can you imagine me, like, just writing dialogue or writing commentary? Like, it might feel okay, but then there'd be no emotion to it. Even if I just have the words better. Like, I know what to say if it was all in front of me. But I feel like I do better when I'm off the cuff. And just shooting from the hip. Even though in FPS's, shooting from the hip is usually inaccurate. So maybe it holds true. <laughs> oh, there's the door. Oh, I thought I could smash that. Oh, I think I need the car. Nope. That did not open. Then I know what I need. I need the hoop. There, I did it. Right, let's put this back on. Oh my god, look, look at that mouth. I don't know if I want to go in there. That's kind of gross. But is it still four when you think about it? I don't even want to know. So why don't I just see what's up here first? Looks like a force field. Alright, so I guess we are going to have to go through the Vordor. One does not simply walk into Vordor. I'm just saying. That's probably for the door itself, never mind. That I just came from. So I think I need to go in here to shut it down. Man, they really love to use that same enemy type. Not a fan of the camera doing that, though. He needs to stop that. Now, I don't know if the camera controls... Or, a or the camera movement was a little bit better in Ape Escape 2. I still haven't played it yet, although I was told you can play it on PS4. Like you could some other PS2 games. So I might look into that. I think it's on PlayStation now. I don't know if it still is. At least you're not streaming off the, like a PS3 because it lags like hell. Whoa! Bouncy. Oh, I thought you had to smash those. Oh, wait a minute! What does that even do? I'm way too late for that one. No? What the hell am I even standing on? What the shit? I clearly was standing on nothing. Game wants to give it to me anyway, alright. I guess they think I'm a dog, because they're going to throw me a bone. Well, so be it then. Alright, force field shut down. 
Now let's see if I can get in there. I do see another eight. Okay, I see. Whoa! Okay, if you shoot me through there, I'm gonna be super pissed. You ass monkey. Oh my god, he did it again! Oh great, now my... Where'd the monkey go? Oh, he just went back there. Okay, can't shoot when I'm on top of the cage. At least, not as well. I wonder if I can goad him out of the cage. Oh no, no, I went back in the cage! You fuck! Get out of the cage! Oh my god. You gotta do this again. I was able to get him out of the cage, and now he has to suddenly go back in the cage. This is not easy to do. Oh, oh my god. Oh my- You gotta be kidding me! He got the car right away. I don't know if the car... Oh! Pfft. What the... What are they thinking with this one? Thank you! I was gonna, like, drag his head through the door if I had the chance. Holy shit. Wait, how do I get in there? Unless it's through the other side of the force field gate. I don't see any way to just get in there. And I don't think it's through this way, is there? No, this has nothing. This is just... All this. I mean, sure, the camera angle can be ass. But I don't see anything of importance. Now you can see why I had this uh, level split into two parts. I had no idea it would be this long, but it is. At least the music is pretty catchy. Now, we should be close to the end. Status. Okay, so I'm missing seven monkeys. And I know at least one of them is in one of those crates. So I know there's nothing I can do about that. Oh, sweet, another extra life. Don't mind if I do. Whoa. You fuckers! You rotated the camera automatically when I'm near a ledge. If that's not bull... Like, not BS, I don't know what is. See, it did it again. So I had to stop right there. But I shouldn't have had to. What? Is that? Well, at least I can hit it. And it's more inaccurate than I thought. If I just stand in the middle, it can't really hit me that well. Let me kill these guys first. Yeah. 
Okay, are you really gonna keep going back that same spot that I can hit you? I bet you that's a monkey in there. Watch. No, that's not a monkey. It's actually nothing. That was useless. Wow. I don't know how I feel about that. I really don't. Okay, I don't know if there is anything in there. Like on top of that cage. I'm gonna say no. So I avoid getting electrocuted. i much rather not get electrocuted, thank you. Especially if it's something I know I could avoid. Where the hell am I being shot at from? Up there? Wait, I can't reach that. How am I supposed to get that monkey over there? That's a little out of reach for me, currently. I think I had to get up there. Oh boy, here we go again. With this uh, balancing act. Oh dear. Is I gonna get another life out of this? That means I gotta be close to the end. They're giving me so many extra lives. Okay, I can't even see what's over there. So... I don't know, do I... Whoa! That's a platform that moves! Can it take me back? Okay, if I do that, yes. I couldn't even react. What was that all about? I just stood there. Let me do the thing. Now, am I supposed to go this way? Now I'm kind of confused. There seems to be more than one way you can go in this. Oh, wait a minute. Is that me on the screen? What the hell? Feels kind of weird watching myself. And I play that sincerely, because I can barely even listen to myself on YouTube. I don't know how I felt about that, I really don't. It didn't make me comfortable trying for that jump. So instead we'll just do this. So I think it has the same result. Take me somewhere I need to be. What about over here? Is that worth my while? So far, no. Cause I can't even get up there that way. And that mech is still trying to shoot at me. Even though I'm so far away. So you know what? If they don't have monkeys, I might as well just... Okay, fine. You want to fight? Okay, maybe not the best spot to fight them. Extra life down there. I wanted. I wanted... I thought I could walk right by that! So they hit you, they keep spinning even more? What? How 
did I miss that time? Yeah, it's still not worth fighting these guys. It really isn't. Like, I'm not gonna get another monkey out of it, or probably not a Spectre coin. So finally, we can go through this door. <sighs> well, the game is actually being generous with the lives now. Hey, I'm not complaining in the slightest. Okay, I thought by some miracle you can actually walk on that. You cannot. Well then. Oh god, this looks kind of scary. Excuse me? Okay, whatever you say, game. <laughs> okay, I thought you could just, like, power run through that, but nope. What? My spin was delayed. What on earth? That don't make sense. I'm um, video game. I'm supposed to be on my side. You got to be kidding me! Oh, maybe I'm not supposed to spin. Just do a regular jump. Would a regular jump be safe? Game knows you're gonna screw up on this a lot. That's why they give you the lives in the first place. No, you cannot just use regular jump. Oh, my laundry's done in the washer. Well, I'm just gonna have to wait. And then I'll put it in the dryer later. Come on, you. Go away. Thanks. Why? How does that make sense? It's like I just fall completely through on the side. Well, then it's not through, but you know, I'm having my moment. Why did I have to make this jump so painful? Oh my god, it wouldn't even spin. I was rotating and it wouldn't spin. Thankfully, I grabbed the ledge. Because I would have been so ornery if that failed. Okay, I think we made it through the worst part. Oh, I thought that was a door for some reason. Okay, now my rotating is just not working out. What is going on? It can't fail on me at the worst time. Just can't let it happen. Okay, what is the purpose of all of these buttons? Okay, that launches me upward. Still launches me upward. Okay, I guess I gotta start moving. Is this the right way? Or was I supposed to go the other way first? I don't know. I think I should go down there to get the monkey.
Even if it means I have to backtrack a little bit more. Oh, maybe I won't have to. Let me just do this. So it looks like I have to go this way again. Which is fine, I guess. Go this way. Oh, you! Oh! Maybe I didn't even have to press that other button. You. No. 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 Okay. We're fine. We're fine. False alarm. Oh, again with the delay. Why does it delay now? And now you won't even grab it. Thank you. Jesus Christ, this level! This one's gonna put you through the ringer compared to all the other stages. Okay, another delayed reaction. That's good to hear. But now what? Where am I actually going? Up there? Wait, I can't reach that. That's too high. Am I supposed to go back through here again? I don't know if you're supposed to climb that. Oh, wait a minute! How do I not see that there? Aha! Now we have platforms. I'm supposed to go this way. Oof. Okay, so that's what I was supposed to do. And we're not even out of the woods. Oh my god, look at this. They really love, like, these narrow bridges. A little too much. It's making me very concerned. As one of the first games I relied on, you know... Analog controls! That's not making things easy. Like, you have to have really good thumb control. Like, much better than what I have. Then again, it was much easier on a regular PS1 controller, I bet. Remember, I'm do doing this off the PS4 controller. Which is still a good analog stick, don't get me wrong. It's just not as good as, say, maybe the Xbox one. Then again, maybe the PS4 controller had a pretty good analog stick, it was the Xbox that had the good D-pad. But anyway, let's try this again. Oh, this is gonna be very annoying, because you had to, like, time it. Oh, I'm not supposed to do the spin. I'm just supposed to keep going forward. Because then I'll land on both of them. This is tedious, because if you mess up, you gotta do all... A nice bit of stuff again. And you better hope that you don't land too far down. And since some of it includes this, it is really, really, really slow. Not a fan of that part. Okay, I don't trust myself not to miss that this, this far. There it 
There we go. That's what you have to do. And we're still not even done with the climb. How much more is left? I don't know how much more of this I can take. Hold on, what does that even do? Oh, am I supposed to do play Pong with this? I think I'm supposed to play Pong with this. Oh! 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 If I messed up right there! Oh, maybe it's not Pong. More like Arkanoid. Breakout. If I missed right there and had to redo the whole segment. I would have just stopped the video right there. I was threatening to do that in my mind. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, I just gotta walk away from the flamethrower. Just hit it. And there you go, you don't have to deal with the bullets. Holy shit. <laughs> Wait, where is this? Is this back near the beginning? I think that's back near the beginning. Oh, this is where it's gonna take me there faster, right? I think so. Okay, that works for me. I guess I can't go through there still. Is that door still closed? Yes, it's still closed. So I have to go back to the main atrium, because that's where the painting was. Oh my lord. <laughs> they were not holding back with this stage. Like, not even close. But I feel like the end is in sight. Oh, you... How did it still catch up to me? You gotta be kidding me! A second hit? Oh, bugger off! Yes, it was in here. Okay. I think I want to pause it here. We got all but three monkeys in this stage. Damn! <laughs> Alright, next episode, we'll go behind the painting and hopefully confront Spectre. See everyone, thanks for watching.